All right, now what we're gonna do next is remove this air fitting from our solenoid assembly. Um, the length of tubing here we can use, it's gonna be the same length when we install our QEV. So our QEV is going to replace this air fitting. Um, what we wanna do is pull this air fitting, which is connected by a hose barb onto this urethane tubing. Uh, and that's gonna be a pretty tight fit. So you wanna make sure you have a good hold of your board solenoid assembly. You wanna grab the urethane tubing out there and grab your fitting here. Okay, and that will be a little tough the first time you do it. This barb's got a good hold on that urethane tubing. So we're gonna set that aside. And now we're going to install QEV into that piece of urethane tubing. Uh, normally it will install much easier than it was to remove that fitting. Right. And the bottom section of our QEV, we have this base, okay, which has two side shoulders on it. We need to make sure that when that's on our QEV, those two shoulders are in line with the body of our QEV to allow it to, tr to drop down through the cutout on our circuit board. Once the QEV has been passed through the cutout on the circuit board, we turn that base of the QEV quarter of a turn, which allows those two shoulders or ears to lock in on the circuit board. Actually, before we do that, we want to plug in our eye wires. Make sure before you plug the eye wires back in that you have the bottom of the wire harness here where you can see the fitting is crimped onto the wires. Have that facing down towards the connector on the board. Hold the wires off to the right side of the QEV. That's our QEV down through the circuit board like that. Turn our base on the QEV. Those two shoulders lock on the circuit board. Okay. And we're gonna reattach the board assembly onto the bottom of the body. snug down our rear fitting and QEV back onto the body. 